My grandmother has become my new guru, my most sacred teacher of life's truths. She is teaching me that porcelain skin must be polished daily, that family means I will bathe you with warm water, bearing tears of joy and forehead kisses gratefully, that life comes full circle. She changed my diapers, now I change hers. This is how my grandmother is teaching me about karma. I am finding depths of compassion I didn't know hid in this echo hollow chest. Find the, finding the joy in selfless sacrifice is no longer a spiritual catchphrase. I understand now, 19 years of running from the Bible and she finally found a way to make me read it daily to her. This is how she was teaching me what Jesus meant. Rubbing aloe vista across my grandmother's butt cheeks, the nurse gives me two critiques. One, you got to really slather it on there thicker. And two, the more the better. You got to really get in those cracks. This is how my grandmother is teaching me that all bodies are equally holy and worthy of worship. I slept on the couch beside her living room hospital bed. I will not leave her side. I tried to sleep on her old bedroom bed, but I couldn't ignore the midnight groans for, selfless, for selfish rest, the oh me, the mercy Jesus, the things she sings in her sleep when turning. This is how she was teaching me of loyalty. Last night, she asked me how I know when I will meet the person I love. I told her I didn't know. She told me I will. We agreed to disagree. She said, I have too big of a heart to not share it with someone. I told her I have a mountain, 16 kids to feed, and an epic personal library to get through. She just lowered her head and said to me, son, slow it down. This is how my grandmother is teaching me how much I cannot learn from books. While cleaning the dried feces from under her nails today, I thought about every time I'd kissed her hands this week, but found no regret in my soul. I finally understood the joy of comforting the suffering, the peace of knowing you prove someone is still lovable by eating a little bit of shit without complaint. This is how my grandmother is teaching me what a heart is capable of. One day, while changing my child's diaper like a pro, I will whisper into their ear, your grandmother taught me how to do this. Though I do not speak the language of children, I know they will understand this tongue I am learning is universal. This is how my grandmother is teaching me the language of love.